<laughs> is it the format is he going to rewrite parts of the story? I don't know yet. There's a statement that James Roach put out and I wanted to read it, but I haven't done so because I wanted to do that on stream. And I only started streaming again yesterday. <laughs> All right. Um, so this was posted on the 1st of January in 2024. Hi, James here. Hope you had a good holiday. New year, new me. The you. Whatever, man. We got the usual Patreon updates for you. Wahoo! <laughs> Wahoo! <laughs> Do you know, that's kind of... What, but that's a kind of fish? What? I watch a lot of fishing videos. Cool. Good, good to know. If everything goes right, nothing goes wrong. We should have something very exciting very soon. A new website. What does this mean for you? Stick around and find out. <laughs> watch until the end to find out. Sorry for the squeaky chair noise. I love my chair. It is very old and it's very squeaky, but it's also very comfortable. Uh, thanks for coming to our Ask Me Anything. I hope we were able to answer some questions. I wasn't there, so <laughs> I have no idea what was asked here. Maybe some of you guys were at the uh, Winter Showcase of Sakon. I couldn't make it because I was hanging out with friends. Missed it. Yeah, same. I hope we were able to answer some questions. I especially like the one where Haven said he was going to... Uh, Fill Dirk full of milk and slap him against the wall. <laughs> Great job, team. In other community news, the folks over at Zalcon are having their New Year's showcase around 5 p.m. Yeah, that, that happened a long time ago. It's not an authentic stream experience until we experience technical mayhem. Yeah. <laughs> Got another great comic update coming with month, and in the next few, we're lighting some of the new writer shine. I'm excited for you to read them. Speaking of updates on things, some of you sleuths, uh huh, problem sleuth reverence, may have noticed some changes. I'd like to go into a little more detail about them to the extent that I'm able. Just like the time I Mr. Funny Man. Cute cutaway gag. You, Mr. Funny Man? But me, you never went, Mr. Funny Man. Kevin, <laughs> he's going to make a lot of fun. <laughs> he's going to make us fun splat. Uh. I also wanted to do this in an official news post, not in social, so that there is no questions about it. The contract with Wiz Media has been restructured. But yeah, this is the thing that I was mostly uh, interested in knowing because I heard about the Wiz Media stuff, uh, but I didn't know exactly what the result of it was. Um, what does this mean? Well, let's start a little further back. We have gotten a lot of questions about Andrew's involvement with... Uh, Homestuck Beyond Canon and Homestuck as a whole. I mentioned before that Andrew approached me to finish Homestuck Beyond Canon. As many of you know, a few years ago, Andrew stepped back from having a creative role. Yeah, that was in 2020. Uh, this has allowed him to focus on oversight and some behind the scenes stuff. A large part of that was regaining a sort of legal control of the brand as a whole. Good news, good news. So who owns Homestuck? Well, Andrew still does. Who has the publishing rights? We're working on that. The HICU has a license to do what we want with the property, which is what has allowed us to do some of the more creative things we're trying to do. Is the website going to be fixed? They're working on that. I have very little to do with that, personally, but once there's something solid to announce there, uh, so announce there and the concerned parties are comfortable with, I'll let you know. What does this mean for the commentaries? Behind the scenes, some ideas about how to handle the issues but with the way Homestuck is going to be published are being discussed. Some of these ideas may include a new way to release the future book commentary in absence of the books themselves. Wow! With regards to Wiz, as some of you have correctly surmised, this is, a good, new this is good news for us. Yes. Because potentially merge. Oh god, what happened with Miss Media? I mean, that they uh, got the rights to publish the books, which... Uh, if Wiz Media loses the rights, by the way, if you don't have the books yet, you really should go get them because they uh, may get out of print. <clears throat> I still need to get, I think, two or three. Uh, it has a lot of things like Homestuck Beyond Canon, HICU. What, what does HICU mean? Does one of you guys know? Licensing, etc. to happen, as well as the Sarkon license. Hopefully this can also include some additional fan-friendly licenses Andrew is considering. This all will take time to fully unfold, so more details will be forthcoming about what this means for Homestuck as a whole. All in all, I think we're in for an exciting year. Man, what else is going on? Some good news on a vinyl. <gasps> vinyl! <laughs> Did I talk to the friend there with such an overwhelming response from you guys? Instead of a simple best of uh, EP, we actually want to try and do a print of volume one through four! 
<laughs> oh my god, I'm shaking my desk already. I don't have a vinyl record player, but I want it so bad. <laughs> Makes all my very scientific and organized data gathering completely useless. I'm humbled by something new and mundane every day. Anyway, this represents a completely different beast logistically. But as a fan of those tracks, I'm very, very excited about that. I will literally buy a record player for the same thing. Same. Can't go feral now. I'm just starting to, I can always. Wait. I can always go feral. <laughs> to consider and get. <laughs> Legitimately. Uh, wait, where was I? <laughs> Um, <laughs> James, you don't own a record player? No, what do you look like? An old man? Please don't answer that. <laughs> I think James and I are in the same age group, so... <laughs> yeah, let's not answer that. This month, January 2024, we are also going to start seeing uh, some of the bonus content go public. I ran a poll for the patrons, and the general consensus is that after two months, they're okay with the bonus content going public. Bonus content? This includes bonus strips, the illustrations, and the commentary. They're really fun to do, so I hope you guys are into it. If you want to see these as soon as they go up, they're available to subscribers. Thank you for that, by the way. It means so well to be able to pay some of the, my team's bills. Look at me, getting all sappy on New Year's Day. Maybe it really is a new year and a new me. <laughs> James is just memes, just like me. <laughs> Still think about how one of his songs is Megalovania, and it is called Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> James's music titles are the best. Here's a summary. James here. New Homestead Beyond Canada website is in the works with some new features. Update mid month as usual. Some of the newer team writers. Uh, this deal has been restructured. That's good for us. Andrew still owns Homestuck. Working on a solution to Homestuck.com debate, uh, debacle. There are plans for commentary. Homestuck vinyl will be volume one to four, pending some light, uh, slight logistical upkeep. Local old person James Fuckhead Roach doesn't own a record player. <laughs> Red Patreon bonus from November will be going public this month. Man, I will have to consider pledging to the Patreon just because, you know, why not? <laughs>